Den wollen wir. Den Boss. Angehen. It's our turn. All right. Time to beat this monster and clear the air. We gotta save Longgren. Ich dachte, das wäre der Vogel. You're not Ramco out of the sky, you jerk. You're in for it now, Besserock. Ha 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 ha
The wind's died down. That's a relief. Not that it'll stay that way for very long. Ever since you left, the wind's been milder in these parts. And it always make me think of you when the breeze blew past. It was nice. Comforting, even. Karina, I wanted to talk to you about that time with the fairy. You know, when I ran away. <laughs> you want to kill the mood already? <laughs> Honestly, I'm just glad I get to talk to you before you leave again. I hated that things were sour between us when you went on the pilgrimage. But at least we have this. I mean, I was mad, but it's all right now. No, it isn't. I should have been there to see you off when you left for Mount Gala. I let you down, even though I'd been hoping you'd be named the Alm for so long. <laughs> That's news to me. Wait, really? You wanted me to be the Alm that bad? Of course. You worked so hard for it. I just couldn't see anyone but you being chosen. So I freaked out when I thought I was getting the job instead. That's why you ran? Yeah. I mean, you dreamed about seeing the world since we were little. Do you know how much I liked that you'd hang on to my every word when I told you the stories I'd been taught? But we both know the Vale is a secluded settlement with strict laws about traveling outside its borders. I knew that's why you wanted to be an Alm. Yeah, but then I got hurt during my training. You might have lost your wing, but you never lost your passion. I always loved that about you. I was so proud of your determination. I know. You never laughed at me for wanting to be the Alm, unlike the others. Thanks for coming back and giving me a chance to tell you what I always wanted to. <laughs> and please allow me to see you off properly this time, Karina. I guess, since you asked so nicely, I can let you do that. Thanks. For always supporting my dreams. Which reminds me, I have a lot that haven't come true yet. <sighs> Journeying across the world is the best, and there's still so much I haven't seen. Places you told me about, places you never even knew existed. Just think of all the things I can learn and tell you later. Ramco and I, we're itching to roam. We'll search through every nook and cranny of this world of ours. That's my new dream. It sounds like a beautiful one. I can't wait to hear more about the adventures of Karina, the explorer. I guess it's time for us to go, Ramco. We still have some unfinished business to attend to before we can begin our expedition. Safe travels, Karina! I'll see you later, Shiryu! You can count on it! Sie weiß schon, dass sie geopfert wird, oder? Wollte nur sagen. So, Karina, who is Shiryu exactly? He's someone who's always had my back. One of my best friends. Finally, a straight answer. I was hoping you'd have one right now. Yep, it's all settled. Thanks, Julie. So. Jetzt haben wir noch mehr Benevidons. Das war jetzt der Wind, das ist Mondlicht. Ganz ehrlich, ja, oder? Gehen wir gleich zum Mondlicht, das ist ja gleich in der Nähe. Parishioners can freely enter Etern now. Hopefully that's the only change we have to worry about. So, mal ganz ehrlich, dieses riesige Stadtding, da haben wir vorher gar nicht gesehen. Wir kennen nur die Brücke. <lacht> P. 
people? Here? In a Terran? The parish is no longer unbreachable. Now everyone can work toward providing a future for our homeland. I do sense traces of Benevidon activity in the area. Don't let your guards down. Really? Nothing looks weird to me. Fairy is right. My fur is standing on end. Though, who can say if a Benevidon is the cause? Huh? Mupa is here. He'll have some insight into what's been going on in the parish. It's refreshing to see a familiar face. Let's talk to Milpa. Nicht, dass das hier auch alles nur Halluzinationen sind. Hi. Das werden wir ja sehen, was er jetzt sagt. Milpa, a pleasure as always. <lacht> Why? If it is in Morley in the Alms. Good to see you. But Morley, should you really be coming back to a town? You still have a duty to fulfill. <laughs> Some unavoidable circumstances bring us to the parish. Don't worry. We are here with the goddess's blessing. Oh, then I suppose the goddess really has given up on a town. What's a little bit of disaster among friends, am I right? <laughs> Are you feeling well, Milpa? Forgive me. I simply find everything funny these days. Since you managed to revive the moon elemental, the scattered citizens of a town have started to return to the parish, hoping to rebuild their fallen homeland. Lately, it's as if everyone has lost their minds. One minute they burst into tears, the next they're fighting in the streets. Turn around and they're laughing at nothing. Forget about repairing the parish. I can't remember what I was talking about a second ago. If this isn't to do with the town's prophecy, I'll eat a pakul. You alms had best leave before it starts affecting you too. Hurry now. <laughs> It's not just my imagination, right? Milpa was acting strange. Decidedly. He's always been a calm, nurturing person. Not one to laugh at other people's misfortune. If these are recent developments, it's likely caused by the influence of the Benevidon of the Moon. But Morley, I'm so, so sorry. It was all my fault. I was wrong. Karina? What are you talking about? You know, back at the Dead Eye Cliffs, you were worried about a Terran's prophecy, and I... <laughs> I callously brushed it off. But you were right all along. If only I'd listened to you, how could I be so cruel? No, I'm pretty sure none of us could have foreseen these circumstances back then. It's not worth crying over. You are being far too merciful, Morley. Palomina? How could you let that Nilpa man get away with such flippancy? He was completely out of line. Oh, I have a veritable tidal wave of tirades that I would visit upon him. In fact, I think I shall. Hold on, Palomina. How will yelling at Milpa fix this situation? <laughs> Karina's in tears and Palomino wants to throw down on innocent townspeople. <laughs> what are the odds? What? Why? Stop picking on me! Do not think that I will let that slight slide. I am righteously irate right now. You're not righteously anything. Woohoo! Now's the perfect opportunity to get some practicing in. Oh no, everybody's gone nuts. Morley, please tell me you haven't lost your mind. I can't be the only sane one. Um, no, I'm unaffected, I think. Pull yourselves together. You're the only ones rational enough to fix this mess. Oh, you look like you have your wits about you too, Fairy. Luna should be okay as well. I'll see to her. You get your companions somewhere where they can rest. 
The parish isn't exactly bustling yet, but there should be an inn we can use. Oh Everyone's god. Everyone's off kilter in this place. Hopefully rest will help. Ich hoffe, ich muss das nicht nachher nicht mit Morley alleine machen, das wird mich abfacken. Ich muss hier mal kurz drauf klettern, weil ich es kaputt machen will, damit alles wieder zerstört wird. Damit diese doofe Stadt nicht mehr so doof ist. <lacht> ja, wir gehen in der Herberge. Das ist natürlich die Frage. Existiert hier drinnen noch irgendetwas, was wir... was wir herbergen können? Wir werden sowieso gleich angeschrien. An ihr meckert. Hier. Hier in die gute Stube, mein lieber Gewalter. Bleibt so lange, wie ihr wollt. Ob eine Nacht oder zehn oder auch gern 10.000. Ja, machen wir. Nach etwas Schlaf geht es den dreien sicher wieder besser. Hoffe ich zumindest. Sleep unless I have my favorite pillow. I want to go home back to Longgren. Come now, turn that frown upside down and have a long and luxurious nap. Dark thoughts catch up with you at night. All nights might look the same to you, but at my age, every shade of twilight is different. I can't deal with this. If only I had lost it, too. Don't you dare leave me alone with him, Morley! Why are we unaffected, do you think? I have an answer for that query. Oh, Luna, it's you. It feels like ages since we last saw each other. Perhaps it has been. The reason you two have stayed unaltered is because of your elemental affinities. You are alms of the heart and mind. Alms of the moon, light, and darkness should be able to resist the influences of the Benevadon of the moon. So Aish wouldn't have gone crazy either? I can't believe I'm saying this, but I wish Aish were here. Until you have subdued Tormarni, I fear that the people of Etern will remain befuddled indefinitely. It is hard to see tragedy once again visited upon the poor people of Etern so soon after it was liberated from stasis. I feel the same, both as a parishioner and an Ulm. It is my responsibility to see that Tormarni is dealt with. If anyone can fix this, I believe it is you, Morley. The Benevadon has taken up residence in Castle Cressenel. The moon has the power to alter people's perception. Please do not be fooled by its shadows or mystique. It's up to us to free Etern from the Benevadon's influence. Shall we, Val? After you, Morley. Let's head to Cresceno and get to it. Hey, you guys. Come on, take us with you. I don't want to stay behind. Uh, let's take them with. Who knows what they would get up to if we leave them alone. Ja, Gott sei Dank. The castle was past the north gate to the parish, I think. It's now or never. No. So, ich habe keine Ahnung, wo das ist oder ob wir schon mal in diese Richtung gegangen sind. Aber oh, bestimmt. Doch, ich, doch, ich glaube, wir standen da oben schon mal vor dem Tor. Als wir das erste Mal hier waren. Der Mond macht mich fertig. Stimmt, da standen wir mal. <lacht> 